Hey guys, these are some of my uh, beautiful female bearded dragons. Um, you got Belly, who is right there, and this is Sunset right here. Um, Sunset I actually hatched out about two years ago by myself. Um, she was one of my first dragons that I hatched out um, and kept. Um, right now they're eating some worms. Um, again, the store didn't have any crickets or anything like that that I was looking for. The shipment wasn't in yet, so... I had to do with what I could get. Um, so right now they're eating some uh, earthworms, some night crawlers, um, to get some of their proteins and stuff like that. Um, they don't really eat the worms too often. Um, I only give it to them maybe once a month and stuff. Uh, most of their diet consists of the crickets, the mealworms, um, superworms, waxworms, when I can get them. Um, they also eat pinky mice, fuzzies. Um, lots and lots of uh, fresh greens, collard greens, kale, carrots, stuff like that that I chop up for them. Um, right now I'm going to bring you over to one of my males. Um, he doesn't really have a name. Uh, he was he was kind of a rescue. I kind of took him in from someone who didn't know how to take care of him and stuff like that. But he is really pretty. So I'll bring you over to his tank now. Try to get him more to the light and stuff so you guys can see what he looks like. He's a really, really intense orange and yellow. Um, he's pretty cool. See if I can eat a worm. Uh, when I'm breeding these, a couple of you pe uh, people out there have asked me how I breed them and stuff like that. Um, I have my bearded dragon set up in 40 gallon breeders. Um, I normally put one male with two females in the breeding season um, in the tanks. So right now it's not breeding season so the males are by themselves. Um, I keep them by themselves so they don't get stressed with the females being around and so on. And likewise the females are in their own tanks. I put them in pairs or in triples. Um, just so they can just relax, eat, and not have to worry about the males, you know, being all over them and asserting dominance and stuff like that. He's actually on a test bedding that I'm testing out right now. Um, I heard online at different forums and stuff that, uh, someone actually uses rabbit pellets, um, for, you know, rabbit feed and stuff which is made out of alfalfa and other greens and stuff like that. So I figured if even if he eats it, he won't get compacted and stuff because it's all alfalfa. So I'm testing it out. Um, I don't really like it. It turns to dust pretty easily when it gets wet or uh, a lot of use on it. So it kind of turns to dust, so I'm not a fan of it. I really like the uh, walnut shells from Zilla or uh, a number of other people and making stuff. It's really good. It clumps up. Um, it's really easy to use. I like it a lot. Alright, well I hope you guys enjoyed the Bearded Dragon feeding frenzy.